What's good, homie squad? It's your boy, homie Ziggy. We back here with another reaction for y'all. And hey, we got Connor Quest with his anime killers rap bodies. Now, apparently, from what he said, this is from this is his first single from his upcoming album that's coming out. And he say with this, and hey, all I can say is with the way how it's called anime killers rap, but the way how it sounds with this. I'm pretty sure we finna hear some menacing shit. Hold on, before we start, let me see who put you who put this all together. So here we go. So we got vocals and lyrics, of course, by Connor. Production by Connor. Mix and mastered by Freshy Canal. And video editing by Nan Yuma. And I've come to realize that they, that Connor and Freshy Canal, their type of production. <laughs> Not gonna lie, pretty fire. Cause I just reacted to like the Kane versus Alistair battle and such. If you haven't, go check it out. I gotta say, with their type of production, their type of connection, might work and such. So we'll see how this sounds and such. So we better check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get into this. Saying spoilers for Chainsaw Man. First of all, I hate when they talk, they put, but and this is not even just for nerdcore and such. Whenever somebody puts this sound, listen. That damn knocking sound. Why you gotta put that in there? Cause you might think I might think somebody's actually knocking at my door. Don't do that. That's a that's a that's a dick move. You trying to you trying to scare somebody with that shit. You're trying to get somebody worried with that shit. Don't do that. down to 180 but hold up Connor talking his hey like I said even though Connor is one of the UK trio and such he is very underrated as in such not just in the UK trio but just in general like hey internet Aaron said it years ago and still to this day I'ma say it too and many as well who reacted to him put some respect on Connor's name and I mean that This man is just what a what do you what do you always hear me calling him the king of illiterate of no the king of literacy meaning that this man will know how to use a metaphor use any type of the the literacy devices to just bend words and make them freaking work it's just when he does it is it's just something Mwah. Not to say anybody else don't do it, but I'm just saying, with the way how Connor does it, it's like even other nerdcore artists realize that nigga, how the frick does he do this shit? Kiss. Kiss. 
lean on your paws cause I'm wooden mm-hmm. neck mm-hmm. Miss, couldn't see your blood from beyond mm-hmm. the red Miss, Miss. mama's picking you up, just leave a Miss. message Whenever I hear bodies on the floor, I just think, oh, what was, I think it was Drowning Pool who said it right, like sings it right, saying, let the bodies hit the floor, let the bodies hit the floor, let the bo-. nigga, you cannot tell, hey, for all my Drowning Pool fans out there, leave a like on this video, cause trust me, you can, hell, even for my, like my old WWE wrestling fans out there, if you have never heard of that song if you if you know about that OG song come on now and I give and it's basically like this without no I'm gonna test some of y'all if y'all some real WWE fans I'm gonna give y'all just one little bit of the answer and such right but the rest y'all gotta find out by yourself no don't you google or anything if you do I will know that you did off the rip I will know that you do it cuz ain't no way you're gonna just well Here's my question. Here it is from wrestling because I know the answer obviously. In 2001, right? Which group had the theme song Let the Bodies Hit the Flow? That's all I give you. I gave you the year, but I didn't say which group. So comment down below and that will make me know you're a real wrestling fan and if you get the answer right I'll give you a heart and you gotta leave a like on this video and subscribe don't be cheating now keep it It was a, hey, all I'm gonna say, Connor, you should have come with the, let the bodies in the flow. You should have, you should have come with some way of that, ski, that little flow right there of, let the bodies, somewhere, because I know you can do it. Like right here, you should have put it there. Down, but they're not quoting Bryson Tiller. Hey, what you know about Bryson Tiller? Down! Faces that white are the nice vanilla trap souls that gas though, but not quoting Bryson Tiller. Catch him if you can, run, run into the forest. It's the thrill of the chase. I love, love it to be honest. Not the bone in the closet. I'm sick and dishing this chronic only goes. Take a metal fork to stick in the socket. Mmm. Gonna stick this. Switch beat. Beat switch. When your last breath is mine, no, I don't know how to show restraint. When your You didn't think Connor one thing we got one thing Connor is very underrated in and we don't appreciate much is his singing. Don't get me wrong. We are we are we known for him for just going crazy with the rapping and such, right? We know that. All the multiple syllable plays, the word plays, freaking alliteration and all that. We know for him for doing that. But the one thing that he doesn't get credit for much is his singing. And we need to start doing that more often for this man, cause goddamn, 
we gotta put him in the likes of like Maguire, Jono, freaking Longest Solo, <laughs> who else? Freaking, uh, like, like one of them niggas, cause, cause I guarantee you, he needs to be talked more for his singing, cause goddamn. Sure is when your last breath is mine You should have come in with the bodies, let the bodies. You should have come in with something like that, man. You should have come in with a little, at least a little part where it says, let the bodies hit the flow. Somewhere, so, somewhere of how you can connect it. Just somewhere. But, hey, man, like I said, we, Connor is very underrated, and we got to make sure we always put him on a, like, one of the, He's definitely in the upper nerd core tier. Like, come on now. Like, hey, hey, nigga. Hey, don't be disrespecting Connor now. Because if we disrespecting Connor, it's on y'all. But hey, man, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. And hey, for when that album comes, no, Diddy. <laughs> when that album comes, I'm going to do a reaction to that album. Cause the same way how we would we did for like Rustage on his albums, well, at one one of his albums I did it for. I got hey for any odd Nerco artist albums out there, I'm gonna make sure I do it for y'all. Cause trust me, I be slacking. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. It's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive. Get the vibes up.